Alright, so this is Joni from Finland interviewing the Montenegrin representative in Kiev. And first off, can you tell us your name and the name of the song you're going to perform? My name is Lauko Kalesic, I'm coming from Montenegro and I will sing my song called Space. Alright, so have you made any albums in your home country? Yes, like in 2014 I released my virtual album called The Dream of Eternity. Uh, ten songs, uh, very different styles, from pop to dance, dubstep, a little bit soul, of course. So it's very unique and it was like, uh, after my master's degree called The Dream of Eternity, I made a solution to release the virtual album. Uh, where did you get your master's from? Drama Academy. Drama mm -hmm. Academy, I finished basic studies of acting, specialization of singing and dancing, and after I enrolled master's degree on the team actors movement in theater of 21st century all right then are you a fan of eurovision i am i am really uh and i there is so many songs i like but my favorite one and from that moment i really got a huge inspiration and moment when i really want to be a representative of montenegro is uh Lorraine's euphoria from 2000 film from azerbaijan the amazing all right, uh, then uh, what do you think of when you hear the name Finland? Uh, when I hear Finland? Yes. Uh, I think of Scandinavia. Uh -huh. yeah, and like uh, all these four countries that are in Scandinavia. I've never been to Finland, so honestly I do not know much about Finland. Yeah. But of course I know that uh, I, I heard so many beautiful things about Scandinavia and about standard and about like a special fairy tale living there. Yes, okay. Then uh, do you have some other special skills in addition to singing? Uh, in addition to singing? Uh, okay, I, I decided for this Eurovision performance to make such a unique and multimedia performance, you know, from acting, dance and singing and I'm really, I'm really humbled and touched that everything goes okay after the second rehearsal with everything is gathered and now I'm ready to hit the stage and I'm okay. Alright, then uh, you mentioned being spiritual in the press meet and greet. Uh, can you tell us how you discovered uh, spiritualism? Just like six years ago, uh, when I met my uh, master of Reiki, that's Japanese technique of universal life energy, and uh, she told me, Saku, you have such a unique energy and such a strong energy, and I think you should go in this, and I have to do your initialization of this and so you can do it on you, by your own and uh, heal so many people around you and I finished three levels of that so now I'm I only need one to be a master of a Reiki but I will need time and to to, to you know practice about three thousand of people uh, with that and I think for maybe two three hours I will be able to take another and at least one level so it helps me a lot because it makes me so relaxing it's like for me like anti-stress you know treatment so it's very good for for artists and everything everybody who is in public you know because it's delivering a lot of energy so you can be relaxed and calm yes uh, yeah, I can see that you are relaxed so it must be working indeed. yeah a lot. Uh, then uh, first questions round are you ready Yes. Uh, favorite color? Blue. Uh, favorite food? Vegetarian food, vegetables. Uh, favorite drink? Water. Uh, favorite animal? Horse. Uh, favorite hobby besides music? Uh, you, mean, you mean gender? Or yes, in general, uh, yes. R&B music. Okay. Um, then uh, favorite movie or TV series? Musical Dream Girls. Okay. Uh, favorite song? Uh, favorite song? Uh, it's uh, oh my God, there's something. But Euphoria, Lorraine. All right. Uh, then uh, finally, favorite artist? Beyonce Knowles. All right. Then uh, thank you very much for this interview and good thank luck in the competition. So thank you so much.